start by talking about my medication. That is you on. This particular kind is from Flora Cal Farms and it is limeade. Basically this probably is very close to tangy which is something I love and it works great for my creativity. It's a very thought processing high functioning kind of Compared to Indica, which is a different variety that I don't have. I just had the money for this. That was it. But, but it also helps me to function. It helps me to... It just it puts you in a good mood for one thing. And it makes you feel better as far as my back and all the other aches that I have. Like stab wound and all that stuff. So, but here, one thing I would also add. And this is... one. There's two reasons why I think marijuana hasn't been legalized federally. First, the alcohol industry would just be, would drop. Their, their profits would, would dip. You know what I'm saying? They're just, they're trying anything and everything to get people to drink still. Coffee, beer, coffee. Yeah, okay, anyway. <clears throat> so they're trying anything they can do. And the other one is, well, pharmaceutical, of course. But, yeah, Viagra. Especially Indica. I think Indica might be a little more influential when it comes to, basically it takes, you know, Takes limpy and makes it hardwood. I mean, not not the problem with it, not that I do, but I mean, it's what it is. It's an aphrodisiac. They don't talk about that. It being an aphrodisiac, which means it makes you horny, and it puts you in the mood. So there you go. If that ain't enough to get you want to, you know, invest and buy and plant, I mean, hemp alone, by the way, is great, and you can grow it in any state in the union. And you can just basically harvest it for the CBD. And that basically is just the oil. And you usually do the tincture or something like that or edible. I'm not sure what they do with that. I don't know if they put that into it. But <clears throat> anyway, those are options. And yeah, I use it for my back. I told you I had, I was doing Norco's and ibuprofen, 800 milligrams, three times a day. Four Norco's a day. And this was for my back when I first broke it. And I was like, done. Seven years of that crap. And I switched to marijuana medical marijuana I was done and it just changed my life around the problem with pharmaceuticals is it having a fog even the the narcos the weird part about those things is they're really high functioning and it's like they're really caffeinated it gets really I don't like it anyway <clears throat> so yeah so that's really not good for you so that's another reason why I think it hasn't really just been federalized in the first place because it would just probably destroy other industries medically because it's just such a powerful thing anyway that's my little thing about medical marijuana, and I hope you love it. I love you, and I'm gonna after this I'm gonna do another one on the ego. You're gonna love it. It's funny. Anyway, have a wonderful day. I love you. God loves you. The universe is you know digging in those pants. Anyway, have a great day.